Welcome back, Flare community. In this series, we're going to look a little deeper into NFTSO, Songbird's latest marketplace. More specifically, we're going to look at how you can connect and set up your profile. So this is the landing page. As you can see, there are some featured NFTs at the top here, including some of the most recent generator projects, which are coming soon. We scroll down, you do have the collection section, which can obviously cycle through and uh, select what you would like. And at the bottom here, the latest NFTs that have been listed. At the top, we have the navigation bar. Now we can actually navigate through various collections here from the ERC specific standard. And you can also check out the featured sections, which include all of the best FTSO contributors. Now there is this oven room here, and that's going to be a story for another day because that's very exciting in itself. We have the wallet, which shows not just your songbird balance, but also NFTP points and shuffle points too. And this is where you're going to be able to manage your bids and offers uh, on the platform. But today we're going to have a quick look at the profile section. And here we go in the settings right here. Now, this is what you will be greeted with when you first connect to the website and you do actually have the ability to customize your profile. For example, there are a number of different fields here. So we have the username, let's just say FC. We also have the Twitter name or the Twitter handle. Community Flare, that's me. Uh, address, I'm going to leave this one blank. And personal site, let's say discord.gg forward slash Flare Community. Perfect. And something else that you can do is actually upload a profile picture and a banner background. So that's what we're going to do. Simply click upload here. That'll do. All you have to do is sign the transaction. And there it is. And finally, the banner background too. You can just click on save. And hey presto, there we go. We got the banner, we've got the profile, and we've got all of our details. So that's basically it. You have your profile set up and whenever you're selling an NFT, people can actually see who is selling it, who's listed it, who's bought it, and all of that good stuff. So that's it for today's video in the NFT SO series. In the future videos, we're going to be discussing much more, including some of the unique features brought to you by this new marketplace. Thank you all so much for watching as always. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe if you're yet to do so. And until next time, I'm out. Permission control, we have liftoff.